All right, welcome. We're in a new deep dive. I'm here at Nima Marcus. I'm gonna go in, introduce you to Oscar Munoz, who's my guy. He is a style advisor here at Nima Marcus. Basically, he curates everything for me. I text him ahead of time, told him that I've got three trips coming up, going in, he lays it all out. The thing I like about having you know, a style advisor is that it cuts out all the time. I don't have to walk around looking for things. He knows my size, he knows my style, he knows my taste. So I'm in and out quick. I usually find what I want. One stop shop, let's go. Let's go meet Oscar. One thing I want to talk about, uh, Oscar was telling me, Nima Marcus, I didn't know this, is actually a, an enormous collector of art. One of the biggest in the country, I believe. Um, all the art throughout Nima Marcus, and Steve, you'll get some of this, even the artifacts like these um, cool antique vases that are above the uh, fragrances and all the art on the walls is all real art, part of the Nima Marcus uh, art collection. It's pretty cool. Hey, Mike. Hey, I was just texting you, dude. Oh, cool. I was just checking out some of this Creed cologne. How you doing, dude? I, I, I was just mentioning about with that fact you told me about the art the collection artwork. and yeah. I, I mean, I've been here a gazillion times. I mean, I always thought it was bright and like cheerful and beautiful. Yeah. I didn't realize it, it was like yeah, massive it, it, collection. And it's not just like the paintings on the wall. It's like the vases. And, yeah. Like, these are all African art, like, antiques. Very, Very cool. cool pieces. Yeah. Hey, before we start, check out this uh, Creed Santal, dude. What does it remind you of? So believe it or not, this, this was actually worn by like Frank Sinatra, Sammy Davis Jr., like the Rat Pack crew. Ooh, that's nice. Yeah. It's like a nice evening, you know, cologne. Beautiful, sun top. And then for your wife. Actually, I really like that. She, she, would, like, she would love this. Straight out wind flowers for your wife. This is a brand new scent for women. Nice little uh, late Mother's Day gift. Mm. <laughs> I'm sure you got her something, something nice. Yeah, always. <laughs> she got herself something. That's how we do it. You know, you know, we just get ourselves yeah. uh, the, our own gifts because we we always know. Yeah, I mean, I, be, I like that Santal. I have to pick one of those up. You know what? I'll add one to your uh, to your room. Okay. Um, I'm hungry, dude. It's amazing. You know exactly what I like. I know. Me too. Salmon tacos. Salmon tacos for <laughs> sure. What's up, Ryan? Hey, good morning. Hey, how you doing? Good. How's good. it going, man? Good, good. I think we're gonna we're gonna. You want to sit outside? Yeah. Yeah, let's yeah we're gonna do outside for, for, two? Uh, for two, please. Yeah, you got it. Yeah. more of these little jalapenos in there. So so this this jalapeno in the consomme uh, is crazy. It's I, kinda, would, I, would, I, would, I would have never thought of that. Where'd you come up with this? It's kind of my signature. You know what? It's kind of one of those things where you where you pick up from your culture, from, from I, just from home, you know? Um, that's how I have my soups at home. What are you, Irish? <laughs> <laughs> Mexican, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Latino. Were you born here? I was born in San Diego, actually. Oh, okay. Yeah, but my parents are from Mexico. Yeah. Yeah. Just right across the border, Tijuana. Really? Yeah, yeah. Oh, nice, nice. I think I knew that, yeah. Speaking of, how's the family? You guys have a nice Mother's Day? We did. We did. I actually worked. Um, my wife actually went to San Diego to see her dad. He just had heart surgery. He wasn't doing too well, but um, he just, just needs a little bit of help every now and then. And um, my mom is actually gonna go to my in-laws. They're gonna meet up and they're gonna go uh, have some brunch, a little champagne at the beach or something like that. And then, uh, and then they're gonna make their way back out here. By the time I get out, I'll probably meet my wife up at the house, make a little dinner. Just have a really relaxing time, you know? Nice. 
Yeah, and then we'll we'll actually celebrate uh, Latin Mother's Day or, or Mexican Mother's Day on May 10th. It's always it's always the same day, May 10th. So that makes it. Yeah, I mean that's that's cool. Yeah. That we. We rotated it based on Sunday, I guess. So yep. it's not always the same. Yeah. Yeah. This, so we. This, by the way, nice recommendation. Oh yeah, right. Dude, it's crazy. So it's, it's like. <clears throat> it's a spice. It, it actually uh, feels tea. like something you would have with, uh, like during the holidays. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. And I hate to say, maybe if you hit it with some rum. Oh. <laughs> oh right. Dude. I mean, yeah. So like. I would. I would actually. We we make some good margaritas here. I would probably do a margarita. Yeah. No. I mean that that uh, that's tasty. Yeah, that's good stuff. Yeah. And yeah, then, so, obviously, so signature, consume, and Lima Marcus, like, they've been doing it for de decades, right? Yeah. And then they hit you with the popover? Popover with a little bit of uh, strawberry butter. Yeah. It's kind of like having dessert before you uh, 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 before your meal. Uh, okay, okay. Really good. Uh, okay. Break, that, break that open, dude. Okay, we got to do it. They're super nice and warm. We got to do it. Very, very, like, airy and well, fluffy. This isn't part of the uh, Get Fit for, for Hawaii program, but... Uh, Oh, dude. I mean, I'll just, have to, the, the, I'll just have to do like an extra 15 on the, the butter. Uh, on the Peloton. Mm. Man. And you wanted to lop down that. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were eating it. That would have been a mistake. Mm. I'm just going to take a bite, dude. Yeah, just one bite. I mean, it's nice because they're, they're hollow on the inside. Yep. It's like, you know. Yeah. It's not. Yeah, you just grab the inside stuff. And yeah, the inside stuff. Yeah. Real soft. I like the crunchy exterior part. It's kind of like Persians have tadik, which is the, the, the crispy rice at the bottom. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is like my. Yeah, I'm going to set it over here. The sapsi polo. Mmm. All right. So, <clears throat> I really appreciate it. I'm good. It's good to see you, brother. It's Likewise, really good dude. to see you. Likewise, uh, always a pleasure. Yeah, little lunch. So, so, what I love about the way we do this is, you know, it's nice. Sit down, catch up, have a little lunch. <clears throat> Not always. I mean, sometimes you know I'm pressed for time. You're always busy, man. In and out of here <laughs> quick. You always curate, like, the exact thing that I need. Um, as I told you, I, like, I hit you up, I, you know, doing um, France in June. We well, got quick, Turkey. Quick trip, drop off uh, my daughter for summer abroad. Okay. Hawaii uh, in August, and then Turkey, one of the guys on the team getting married, which uh, is gonna be a cool destination wedding. So okay, cool. uh, just, you know, fun, easy to travel, comfortable. Yeah. You know, so so I, I, actually, I actually have a room set up for you. Yeah. After we uh, finish lunch, we'll uh, walk over there. Right. Show you what I have. Um, I'm pretty sure you're gonna like what we but it will be Thank picked you. out. Thanks, thanks. Wow, look at this. This is awesome. That's the uh, tartar. Woo! With some plantain chips. That's a beauty. That is nice. Mm. Oh, here we go. Right. These entrees for you. I can oh. move those plates out of the way if you guys are done. No, yeah, yeah, we're done. We can put that aside. There we are. You know what? I'm actually going to keep one of the plates because yeah. uh, I'm going to give myself a taco from one of these. I never had that salad before, dude. It's never never seemed uh, appetizing for me for some reason, but looks good. Hey, brother, how are we uh, looking on time? Uh, you were up against it, so good? yeah. No, I mean I think we should rock. So okay. yeah, so we can go go hit go hit that everything you laid out for us. Perfect. It was amazing as always. What oh, a great dude. great lunch spot. Yeah, my pleasure. Uh, grab my jacket. Uh, all right. That's view, man. I know, I know. Steve, get the view. Think of the sound of tacos, dude. It never disappoints. I mean, I love that restaurant. As a matter of fact, I remember as a kid, 
in San Francisco going up to Mar the, I think they called it Mariposa's Bay even back yeah, then. Yeah, I think there was two different. Uh, no, it was the Rotunda. Okay. It was the Rotunda, the Rotunda restaurant up in, in uh, downtown San Francisco, that old, oh, yeah. beautiful, beautiful with all the stained glass the and everything. The dome on the top. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But anyway, I love coming here for lunch, you know, and I always love seeing you. So thank you, man. I appreciate it. Tell me what we got going on. All right. So you told me you were going to Paris. You got Hawaii coming up. Yep. And then you got Turkey. Yep. Yep. All right. So with that in mind, I kind of picked out a few things for vacation wear and also a few other things that I kind of wanted to show you. Things that are a little bit on trend. I didn't want to bombard you with a bunch of stuff. Just wanted to kind of do a few basics and then we can kind of walk the floor and see what you like. You know, there's other pieces. But for the most part, I've got some really cool um, items here from Xenia. Some of the most comfortable page uh, pants, drawstring. These are awesome, dude. Okay. It's got a great cool. fit on them. And it's going to look great with like basically everything that I have here for you. Okay. You got your white, you got your blue. All right. So you get some linen. Yeah. So you get some lightweight sweater pullovers. You know, I love hoodies exactly. and pullovers. I'm a big sweater guy. This is all Cuccinelli. Beautiful. What do you think of the uh, espadrilles from Xenia? You know, you know I me. Mean, you always push me a little bit. I normally would go very safe. Those are cool. I'll throw them on and see how they look. You know, those. What about are, the Cuccinelli uh, Birkenstock? You know, like style. I said, let, let's throw them on and see what they look like. I yeah. mean, you know, I, I just think it'll look really cool with this outfit I pre-selected for you here. It's kind of a you know more of a Laguna vibe. Very I just want to make sure it's super comfortable because I'm going to be doing a lot of walking. Yeah. Especially in Europe. Absolutely. Um, yeah. We'll, what we'll else try you got? on. You got, uh, uh, I've got that leather, lightweight leather jacket I was telling you about. Okay. Really cool color. Cool. Yeah. It's like super a, lightweight. I mean, it's almost like paper thin. Yeah. Yeah. Is it lamb or Beautiful. something? Beautiful. It is. Yeah. 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 And polos. I know. <laughs> I, know. I live in polos. <laughs> I know you were having some issues with uh, another. <laughs> named brand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, right, we'll, we'll give these a try. Yeah, the Cuccinelli ones are really nice. This looks cool. Yeah, I mean, I. I well, I'm going you, to Hawaii. You're going to Hawaii, yeah. yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't want There's you to There's like wear, three uh, different trips that we're looking at. So we, we're kind of jamming it all into one just because I don't exactly. have a lot of time to come back here. Some um, shorts, swim trunks. Shirts. Okay. All right, cool. Well, let's, uh, as you know, let's we'll jam through yeah, this. Let's move quickly. Yeah. I know you were, you're pretty short on time. Yeah. All right, um, cool. So I'll, I'll let you. I'll let you try this stuff on if you want. Maybe start with that outfit there, and then come out and see if you like it. Okay, cool. Cool. All right, thanks. All right, man. You all set, dude? Yeah. Cool. I think the pants may be a little bit big. Let's go look in the mirror. But yeah, just wanted you to check out something real quick. All right. So how's the waist? It's good. It's good. Actually, so I think what we can do actually, is like is maybe tailor the leg a little bit so it's not so baggy. But I mean, you want to be a little bit more comfortable when you're on vacation, you know? Mm -hmm. You don't want to be too, you know, too uptight. Uh, the length, how's the length? A little bit long, right? Yeah, probably. Uh, yeah. Like a half an inch yeah. or so? Yeah. Go ahead and face the mirror real quick. Just want to see how it would look. And then we can call a tailor when you're ready. But I kind of want to like to keep the pants on the shorter side, especially if you're on uh, vacation, you know, doing a lot of walking around. Yeah. So kind of like, yeah, so you're not dragging all over the place. I normally like a more fitted pant, but it, I kind of like this vibe. I mean, yeah, it's more it's, of a, it's like a like casual, like, you know, wear it with a t-shirt. Exactly. Have a little sweater, whatever. Yeah. Right, awesome. And then yeah. check this out. This is good. I like this. Not, not that you would wear a matching jacket pant like this, more, more on the casual side. Is this actually matching? This is the actual matching uh, oh. piece from Theory. Well, does it, uh, Check it out. I mean, if, if, you're, if you're out and then you want to transition into like yeah, like a if you or exactly. And I mean, look how look how cool this is. I kind of like to like if the um, if the top is a certain color, I kind of like to kind of match it with the shoe mm -hmm. to kind of you know get get a really nice you know visually appealing look. Isn't that cool? Yeah, I like this. What is this color? It's like a grayish. It's kind of like a like a like a putty. Green putty. Color. Yeah, I, I I don't really see the green in there. I guess it's more of a tan, huh. like a gray tan. I kind of like it. I mean, like you said, I mean. Normally... So do you do you like the shoes now? Now that you see the whole outfit together, be honest. They're growing on me. <laughs> <laughs> I told you. I told you, me. dude. I'm not usually like a Birkenstock kind of a guy, but uh, they're growing on me. Yeah, I like the feel and the vibe yeah. of this. It's like very cool. It's like very like, you know, vacation-y. Exactly. Like is it yeah. linen? 
It's uh, It's got a little bit of linen in there. It's kind of a blend. Okay. A little cotton, a little linen. And again, I mean, you, this is stuff that you can you can uh, interchange yeah. with all the other stuff that you're gonna have. Like, you can you can do the white pant instead with this hoodie, right? You know, and then you can do the top with the white pant. Right. You can do this with jeans. Did, did you think that this was the right size? Theory does run a little small. That is a large. Yeah. What are you thinking, bigger or smaller? smaller. You know what? I'll bring I'll bring the medium just so you see how it fits. But honestly, I think the the large is fine. Yeah. Uh, sit, I like it. Let me take the hood back out of here. I love the pants. I mean, they're they're like they're super comfortable. What are they? I mean, These are a page. No, but what are page they? Page denim. Oh, it's it's uh it's cotton and a little bit of elastic. Yeah, yeah. Actually, a lot of elastic. They're really comfortable. I mean, I'm really honestly like in discomfort. Like, I, you know, ever yeah. since we've transitioned into like the the fancy sneakers yep. and like the polo like just being comfortable yeah i rarely wear suits but you know i thought i'd wear one for you today you know well, i mean these suits are, this is like pajama material anyway so. all right mike so what do you think see these pants i love these pants man yeah these are the like, same as same brand as the white one. Same as the white one. Yeah. yeah. Super comfy. I like the color. I just think we need like to, we need to tailor it a little bit more so it's not so chunky on the bottom. Yeah. Just chop off enough of it so that you can pull it once or twice. Yeah, obviously, like just chill. Yep. You don't have to wear undershirt. So no undershirt with any of these. And then I, I also wanted to show you this backpack, man. Because for travel, you want to have all your essentials. This Cuccinelli one is super, super luxe. Beautiful, beautiful leather. It's one of those backpacks that will get better with time. You know, like you uh, can, you age can out. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. trash it. You, you know, you get it dirty, whatever. It'll just get better and better with age. Okay. Kind of like, kind of like you, man. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't scripted. All right, that's cool. Yeah, this is good too. That's All a right. cool piece. Uh, you know what? Before I wanted to show you a uh, sport coat. We I didn't really show you any, but I was thinking about it. You're gonna be in Paris. You're gonna probably want to go to a nice restaurant, and they do have uh, requirements, yeah, dress course. code requirements. Yeah. So why not, you know, get a nice little lightweight cotton yeah, blazer? Try. You're already getting this. It'll be really cool to just kind of wear that over that. And then you know what? You can even wear it with these pants. You know, I'm a fan of the monochromatic look. Yeah. I mean, as you can see, what I'm wearing right now. Yeah. This will be great. I mean, it's a lot of blue, but it's done it's right. My favorite color. Cool. All right, dude. You look like you just you know walked out of a catalog, Cuccinelli catalog. You know what? This, this does have a matching pant. We didn't get one here. Okay. But if you really wanted one, I can get one for you. I mean, it would be a great suit. I think we just need to tailor the jacket a little bit, just so that it's a little bit more fitted on the body. Okay. Just take it in a little bit here, give you that hourglass shape, you know? But other than that, I think it's pretty dead on, you know? Yeah. So you got that Hawaiian shirt on? Perfect. All right, see, there you don't, go, dude. Don't pay attention to my, my skinny white legs. <laughs> <laughs> That's why you're going to Hawaii, man. You're going to get tanned. Yeah, well, like my, my face is tanned, but no, Or you should do like a pre-vacation vacation so you can get nice and tanned. Yeah. At the, go to Mexico first. At the water. Oh, there you go. Oh, this is cool. Cool. Right, cool. You like the fit of it and everything? White. And then, yeah, I mean, a white pair of shorts to go with it instead, Dude, too. These are really comfortable. Do they come in white? Um, they don't. Okay. I don't have a white pair of these. But I, do like I have a tan pair like and I have like a like a dusty rose. Would you do me a favor grabbing a medium? These are oh, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No problem. Be right back. Man, thanks so much. My pleasure. You're always the best. Dude, thank you, dude. You're always the best. Appreciate it. Say hi to uh, your wife for me. I will, same to you. So that's a wrap. This is what it's like having this curated, hands-on experience at Neiman Marcus. Come see my man, Oscar. Thank you, I appreciate it. It's all best. Appreciate the business. Okay, bro. Thank you, bro. Yeah. Take care.